I went shopping! As you can tell from the title, I did a little bit of shopping. Honestly, not too much, considering. Not too much. I went to Stradivarius and I went to Bershka, my two favorite stores right now. I say right now, probably for the last like year. And I got a few things, so I thought I'd show you. I feel like my style's been changing a little bit over the past like year, um, and I'm very intrigued by it. And Bershka and Stradivarius just seem to have the cutest things. Here we go. The first thing I would like to show you is the cutest little skirt. Tell me this is freaking adorable. I got this in Stradivarius. This was 22 pounds and 99 pence. I have a similar skirt like this and I love the vibe. I love the whole pleated vibe. Um, I think it's from Stradivarius actually, my other one. And I got it for Christmas last year. So it might be in my what I got for Christmas last year. Check out that video. Not the one that's on my channel most recently, 2021. But it's really short and I've gained a little bit of weight. So it's gotten even shorter. It's got like a chain on it. It's super, super cute. And I do wear it when I have like tights on. Um, and if I'm just like maybe a house party or something, I'm not really going out into the world. Um, but this I have tried on and it fits like perfect. It's not too short. Um, and it's also like baggy enough for me to be able to put in like a jumper if I want to have like that kind of winter vibe. Adorable. Can't go wrong with a little skirt. And I need more skirts. I don't have that many skirts anymore. I used to be a proper skirt person and now no more. This would look super cute with tights or knee highs. And I know it's still like, it's bloody January, like it's still cold, but like eventually we'll be transitioning into spring. And I feel like cute little skirts like this with knee highs. Such a spring vibe. Plus I'm going to Paris in like March, potentially. This is a Paris outfit if I ever did see one. I know the skirt needs ironing. I'm aware. <laughs> I know. And my cat slept on it last night because it was on my fucking floor. Because <laughs> I knew I was filming this today. Um, so ignoring that, I think it fits super well. It's like the perfect length. It goes with, I feel like, everything. If this had every other colour, I would definitely buy it. I think it's adorable. I'm a big fan. Big, big fan. 10 out of 10. Then in Bershka. Oh, okay. I've tried this on already, um, which is why it's a little inside out. <laughs> it's the softest material you ever would feel in your entire life. This is freaking amazing. It's like cropped. It's a really good, um, I thought I was going to be worried that like my boobs are going to be out a bit, but they're not like at all. It's a good, it's a good length. At least 60% recycled polyester, which we love. It feels amazing. You could have like a cute bralette underneath it. When I first bought it, I thought you might need to have like a cute bralette underneath it, but because it's a little bit like I don't know what the word is, woven? But it's actually not that bad, you can't really tell. I mean, it's a little bit chilly, then it might be a little a little hard, but apart from that, this is super cute. My only issue is I got this in a size extra small, I'm pretty sure, because I, I always go extra small when it's like crops because I don't have much here. <laughs> but I actually kind of, I guess, um, what's the word? Underestimated how much, because I think I should have got small because it's fine, but it's a little tight. I would have liked to be a bit more free. Um, so yeah, I'd maybe size up um, if you were gonna go get this, but it's weird because I also bought a similar one uh, in green and it's a bit of like a different vibe, it's a bit more crop. Okay, I've learned something. I only put this top on before you do your makeup because now I have foundation stains all over it, but it's fine. I love the sleeves, I love the tie up. Honestly, it's perfect. I feel like I literally can't fault it. It's adorable, it's so fucking soft. I, I just, I want you to like feel it. It's so freaking soft. I can't remember where it's from. I think Bershka. I think this one's from Bershka. It's so cute. Also, still a cute outfit with the skirt. Everything goes with this fucking skirt. But I got this in Bershka as well. And I got this in a small. And it fits perfect. So maybe you shouldn't size up. <laughs> maybe you should just go for what your actual sizes are. I thought this was freaking adorable. My only issue is, what do I do with this? Am I supposed to cut this? I don't know, because I tried it on again. And um, I put it at the back and it was fine, but it was a little, I felt slightly restricted. But I don't know if it's meant to be like that to keep it from like drooping all the way down because it already is kind of low. I'm really not sure. I feel like this is very Aria Montgomery <laughs> style. Like if she was wearing like a vest underneath it and then this, cause it's quite like short. Um, but it was giving me like um, Urban Outfitters vibes. I'm a really big fan. I think this was like 25 pounds ish but I'm really liking the vibe. Okay, you can't tell me this isn't the cutest top you ever did see. It's so freaking comfortable. It's adorable, I love it. And we are actually adding freaking green. We're adding colors, guys. <laughs> I still don't know what I'm supposed to do with the back though, so if someone please help me out with that. Also, tell me it doesn't match this skirt so fucking well. It's adorable, oh my God. I love it, I love it so much. Okay, this I think is freaking adorable, but I don't have a, um, I've got so much lingerie and I've got so many bralettes, like cute bralettes, um, because I'm obsessed. But I've now realized that I don't have a black one. <laughs> I've got all the colors under the fucking robot, but not black because this is very see-through and it's adorable. Thank you so much for that. 
this is adorable, but it's um very see-through. And I don't know if I'd want to just wear a top underneath that. I feel like a bralette and make it a little bit more edgy. And do you remember the H&M jackets I'm obsessed with, with the fur, the black one and the white one? Look. More fur. That's oh, so freaking cute. This was from Bershka as well. Yes, I have a cold. That's why I'm like all banged up. This was £20 and I got this in an extra small as well. But this is the thing, extra small, this fits perfect. It doesn't make any sense. The sizing is a bit weird in Bershka, I think, or maybe I'm the problem. I would just like to point out this would not be what I'd be wearing with it. <laughs> this bra is not the fucking one. <laughs> Believe it or not, I I don't have a, um, a black bra. <laughs> Like, this is supposed to be, like, worn with some super cute black cor uh, corset, like, bralette. And, like, it'd be super cute because these are my... <gasps> it's already come off a little bit. Oh, that's not good. Maybe I can super glue it. I have nail glue. I'll use that. <laughs> but these are my favourite parts of it. I'm not really a, um... I see girls all the time wearing, like, leather trousers and tops like this, which look fucking adorable. I need to get some leather trousers. Um, that's a whole vibe. Love that. But I'm not normally a big fan of the um, see-through stuff, but it's the sleeves that sold it to me because so cute um, when I super glue it on. And I feel like, again, it'd be super cute, mm, maybe not with this skirt, but yeah, it does obviously not go with this bra, but I just needed to show you. <laughs> but still not terrible, right? Right? <laughs> I still like it. Oh, this is Stradivarius. I don't know how much it is. I've already tried this on. Um, I love this. They also have this in like a khaki green. Um, it's like a knitted, tight, like, completely long dress. I don't know what you'd call it. It's not a maxi dress, but it's also got a slit in it, which, you know, a little bit edgy. Um, this I'm obsessed with wearing with my cowboy boots. Uh, where are these from? I feel like these are from, oh, they're from Primark. Yes, because I wanted the Stradivarius ones and I tried them on and I really, I was like really struggling trying to get them. This is completely irrelevant. I bought these ages ago. <laughs> but uh, these are like a really cute outfit together. Um... And yeah, I bought these. These were a lot cheaper than the ones in Stradivarius. And honestly, they've done all right. So if you want cowboy boots, Primark might be the place for you. Just say it's the softest thing you ever would feel. This is so freaking cute. The turtleneck, kind of turtleneck? Yeah, turtleneck. I feel like it looks quite flattering and I struggle with my hips, as we already know. The slit just gives it a little extra, extra vibe. It's very soft, very like good material. I love it. I love it a lot. This is kind of perfect for like wintry spring vibes. Solid 9 out of 10. And I think they do this in a khaki green as well. I haven't seen any other colours, but yeah, I love this. I love this a lot. The tree's kind of in the way. And you know how I feel about my corsets. Love me a little corset. So Bershka had a few adorable ones. We love a little bit of lace. Tell me this isn't adorable. If this was a bit thinner, then I would probably wear this under the see-through thing, but it's a bit too thick. But this is so comfortable. My only issue is the label sticks out. I've got pictures and you can see the label through the... Um, through the lace <laughs> but I mean it does say to cut it but I always get worried when I cut labels because it gets really itchy um so I might just tuck it I'm not really too sure yet but I've worn this a few times already considering I bought like all this stuff like a week ago and a lot of it I've already worn <laughs> but then I put it back in the bag so I can sit down and show you so freaking cute apparently I am a child who cannot get dressed by themselves why is this not going in <laughs> there's no one else home I need help corset I wore this to an event the other day and I got like all compliments so I think it's pretty cute. My only wish is that um obviously it is a label. I try and put it this way so you can't see it and all you are gonna be like just cut it off. It's gonna make it itch and I don't want to be itching all night. Honestly I love this. I think it's fucking adorable. Again not with the skirt but look how pretty. What a vibe. Ah can't go wrong with a black corset. Oh also I got this um this corset. Super cute super adorable. Basically the same as the lacy corset but instead of lace it's just plain black with like a few like more texture kind of like rouge texture it's adorable again i think they were all like 20 pounds each -ish. okay this is potentially my favorite corset i do really like the other one and i like the whole lace vibe and i know this is pretty plain please ignore the dog barking again wouldn't wear it with this skirt but there's a pair of parachute trousers that i've got which look so good with this outfit and i wore it the other day and i went out for a drink and when I tell you I looked so fucking good, I wanted to take Instagram pictures, but there wasn't a good place to, and then it got dark. So I need to redo that outfit and take Instagram pictures because I looked so good. Just saying, she said humbly. But yeah, super cute, I love it. And I feel good in it. I feel like my small tits actually look like there's something there, which makes me feel great. <laughs> it's all good. There's a dress that I bought from Stradivarius, which is black, like um, folded. It's adorable. 
I can't find it <laughs> because I wore it out and I washed it and now I have no idea where it is. But hopefully um, I would have found it by the time I'm editing this. And that is everything that I got. Hello, editing Ellie here. I know I said that's everything that I got, but it isn't. I bought another dress. I just forgot for some reason it was, I guess, at the bottom of the bag that I didn't see it. It's also a black dress. And I know I spoke about another black dress. It's not that black dress. So there's two black dresses. One's missing. This one I didn't like intro, but I did try it on. So here you go. When I tell you I love this dress, I feel like my hips look a little bit funky, but when I look at pictures, I'll be able to be more like, um, make a proper opinion. I have a thing about this at the moment. I know it's very like 2015, but I feel like it's coming back into style. Um, it's long, it's it's like figure hugging. There's a little like ruffly rougey thing here. I kind of love it. I think I look kind of like classy. I might wear this on like a dinner date kind of vibe. I really like it. Tell me if I'm being a dickhead. Tell me if this doesn't go. These plants are very aesthetic, but God, they're annoying. What do we think? I kind of, I kind of like it. I think I love it. Ah! Not a massively long haul, I know, but I felt like I needed to show you because these are some of the favorite things that I've bought from Shadowarius and Vershka in a long time. And you're gonna be seeing a lot of these in like January because this is like my whole 2023 vibe. I've got other hauls on my channel being Vershka, Shadowarius, a million different hauls, so make sure to go and check them out. If you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe because we are uploading so much in 2023. Thank you for watching and I'll see you when I see you. Bye.